this is Brad Harvey with Harvey Investment Management, and today we're going to talk about asset custody and why that's important to you. What is custody? Custody is very simply the safekeeping and reporting of your assets. A custodian is typically a large bank or brokerage firm like Charles Schwab or Fidelity or TD Ameritrade. They're the ones that hold your investments. They're also in charge of saying what those investments are worth and they're in charge of executing trade orders or taking delivery of trades that were executed away. Okay, this is the, what we call the custody rule. The custody rule was adopted in 2009 after the Bernie Madoff scandal, which required advisors to actually have custody at a separate institution and not have complete control over those accounts. So what this means is at Harvey Investment Management, we use an outside custodian, such as Charles Schwab Institutional. That's where our client assets are actually held. We may direct those assets, but at the end of the day, we don't have physical possession of them. We can control trades and we can do things like that, but we cannot take money out except for fees. We have to follow client instructions and the clients have to have access to those valuations and that information directly from the custodian. That's why our clients receive duplicate statements. They get a statement from the custodian showing the value and the assets that they have there, but they also get a performance report from us that says how those assets have performed. Why is this important? It's important as a safeguard for your assets. So if your custodian says you have a thousand shares of Microsoft, you know you have a thousand shares of Microsoft and it's in your name. One of the problems that we had during the Madoff scandal was Madoff Securities or Madoff Asset Management, they held all of their client assets in a common account, okay? Rather than having separate accounting for each client, that was a problem. They co-mingled those. That's not a good thing when it comes to reporting. So as a help to check on the system, to reduce the incidence of fraud, all advisors are now required to have separate custody of client assets. If you're wondering how your assets are being custodied, you should ask your advisor. They should be able to answer this very quickly and very easily. So remember, custody of your assets is very important. You need to look into that. This is Brad Harvey with Harvey Investment Management. Hope you have a great day.